Hidden inside the play deck are the actual suspect and weapon cards. It's up to you to be the first to learn who that is and recover the weapon card. It's also your job to collect enough guilt points to make an accusation. The backs of the cards in your hand must be visible to all players at all times. This is so that each player knows how many, if any, action, guilt, suspect, or weapon cards each player has. This is key to stealing certain cards from certain players. For example, if Joe doesn't know the suspect and sees that Lisa has two suspect cards in her hand, it's possible that both are dead-end cards, or that even one card could be the actual suspect card. For two to four players, you need at least 40 guilt points to make an accusation. For five to six players, you need at least 30. You do need the proper amount of guilt cards in your hand and the actual weapon card in your hand in order to make an accusation. You do not need the suspect card in your hand to make an accusation in order to win. Here's an example turn. Let's suppose that the actual murder weapon for this game was the mace. You have five cards in your hand, and you decide to draw a card from the play deck. You see it is an action card. Your new action card allows you to take two cards from any player. You see that Joe has three action cards, one guilt card, and one weapon card. Seeing that you know the suspect is Demetrius, and still don't know where the weapon is, you use your new action card and lay it down in the discard pile. You then tell Joe you are taking one of his guilt cards and one of his weapon cards. You discover that the guilt card is a coveted 15 point guilt card. And when added to your other 5 points and 10 point guilt cards, you now have enough to make an accusation. The weapon card, however, was not the actual weapon. You don't want to keep the wrong weapon card, so discard it into the discard pile so that you end your turn with no more than 5 cards. What if the card you drew was the actual weapon card, which was the mace? With enough kill points in your hand, you are now ready to make an accusation. Announce to the other players that you are ready to accuse, and announce Demetrius killed the victim, and lay down your actual weapon card and guilt cards. You can even have fun and read out the story based on your hand. Demetrius killed the suspect with the mace. He has been known to talk rubbish about the victim. Demetrius' alibi is full of holes. You found a threatening letter from Demetrius to the victim, and a bloody handprint matching Demetrius' hand was found at the murder scene.